Hi, Leo. It's Jackie from Sacred Journeys. How are you? I hope you're having an awesome day. So we're going to be looking at the energies of this weekend for you. We're going to look at the April 14th through the 17th. And let's see what they want to say. I'm using the angel cards. And remember, these are general readings, so you can always check out your moon sign and rising sign as well. So, I have... The moon. Wow. The moon jumped out for you. It's talking about um, tapping into your psychic abilities. Tapping into... The unknown realm, seeing past delusion and seeing past the under thing. Like there's always something going on behind the scenes. So this is a weekend where you may be able to see what's going on behind the scenes, Leo. You know? Oops. And uh, tap into your intuition to see because if there's something going on, you need to know. Wow. Leo, this is your sun. Look, it's a sign. It's, it's you, the sun. Huh, so it's, that's beautiful. Look how beautiful that card is, Leo. So whatever is going on, you're you know you're you're doing your work, you're researching, you're seeing what's beyond the the surface, kind of, and you're going to be rewarded. The sun is shining on you, and it's beautiful. It's positive energy. It's so awesome. So just have confidence. You're Excuse me, you know what you're doing. You are doing it. You're just rocking it. So let's see what else is going on. No, I don't, I don't think that's... Okay, it came up. I, I'm sorry. Seven of Air came up. So maybe there is something else going on that you're aware that there's something fishy going on. The sun is telling you, yes. You do know. You recognize what's going on. And there is something going on. There is some deception involved, which goes hand in hand with this moon. So it's like, okay, Leo, what are you aware of? What are you aware of that has been kind of like on the external, the peripheral, I would say, the peripheral? What has been on the peripheral that you've been aware of that you're not quite sure? You haven't been able to put your finger on something? But this weekend, it looks like there's going to be something found out. And you're right. There's something more going on than meets the eye. And you're right. You are brilliant. You've been able to pick that up. And this is a sign saying, yeah, there's some deception going on. There's something not quite right. You need to revise your plans. You need to think, rethink something. Um, because you've already been aware of this. You've already been having that feeling. You need to think something through. Or look at it from a different space. So there you go. I would like to just draw another card for clarification. I don't know why. I just, every time I see the seven of air, oh, I just, it makes me cringe. I don't know why. Oh, okay, the king of air. The king of air. Okay, so you may be actually dealing with um, an air sign this weekend. Or this may actually be an attorney. Oh, this may be an attorney. So that you've been working with and you've been trying to find out things. Because it feels like this may have been going on a while because you have been having suspicions. You have been asked to look at things and you've been, you're right. Your suspicions have been right. And so you have, might even be talking to an attorney. If you're not already, you may be contacting an attorney this weekend because there's something going on that's, not, it's just not, it's just not okay, <laughs> for the lack of better terms. It's like something fishy. I can't quite put my energy on the, or put my finger on the energy, but it's like there's some shady stuff going on, and you're getting close to figuring it out. You just got to keep, keep asking the right questions, keep consulting, keep researching, researching with the right people. And, uh, but the sun's got your back. You're the sun, right? So the sun's got your back. You just, you keep doing you. Know, know what you know. Trust what you know. And it will be, it will be okay. Because this, this is a diplomatic 
person. It's diplomatic. It's, um, oh, and I need to remind you, Mercury is in retrograde. So really, truly, keep that in mind in all your communications. Because this is an, this is the air card, the seven of airs, talking about communication, thoughts, uh, writing, texting. Don't text. Don't text if you can help it. Say all your things in person or on the phone, at least on the phone. And uh, be clear and concise in your communication. Especially if you're trying to get to the bottom of things. Be very clear and, and diplomatic about your concerns. Don't, don't get emotional. Because I know you're very fiery, and that's awesome. I love fire signs. However, it feels like if you're trying to get to the bottom of something, we need to be more diplomatic and... Uh, use just use a different way of communicating, not fiery emotional energy. Be more diplomatic about it. Um, but you've got, I mean, you got this. It's okay. It's gonna be okay. It's just, it's just doing your thing, Leo. Yeah, sorry, that's kind of a heavy reading. Sorry. I hope everything goes well this weekend. Okay, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.